confusion of the tongues at Babel. New clusters of people who spoke the same language emerged and rallied around a new leader. The ancestors of the Arabs left under their leader Gul and settled at the Delta, present-day Egypt, after the fall of the Egyptian Empire. The Arabs migrated under a new leader Me through the Sahara Desert to Sudan and called the place Ketu. But then came the drought, famine, and the endless wave of attacks by the Arabs, forcing them to flee to the sea, now Ethiopia. They moved southwestward, to the region between the bend of the river Niger and the middle reaches of the Senegal River, where they contributed to the rise of the old Ghana Empire, which collapsed and was replaced by the old Mali Empire under the face of King Mari Jatta. After the death of Mari Jatta, his empire disintegrated and fell at the feet of the Songhai overlords. The Ewers moved southward towards the Atlantic coast following the Great Niger River into Nigeria under their leader Sioux and settled at Ilefi where they found people. They practiced the old art of divination their ancestors had abandoned in Babylon and learned the ancient art Ifa and continued their quest to find a place they could call home. After splitting up into three factions, Tado, Noche and Doboibo, the Dobos had a leader called Wenya, whose nephew became the first chief of all Dobos in Noche under the stu name Sri the First. They and the people of Noche lived under Kinagokoli in peace. From thence, the story begins. How soon will it be completed? Soon, my king. Soon. Move it! Move it! Move it! Pick them up! done to ourselves. What about him? Zardua. Speak up! Your nephew, Zardua! Zardua has killed a double member! Inamia Hedune! And they are calling for his execution as demanded by the law! What? Aga is dead! And Zardua killed him! They are here. They've come for him. He is my nephew. We made the law, my king. We must uphold it, no matter how difficult it is. Do you know what you are asking me to do? Yes, I do. No, you don't. You killed one of them. Don't kill me. Don't listen to him. I didn't kill that man. I need proof of Aga's death. They refuse to let us see his body. It is against their custom. I didn't kill that man. I'm innocent. Then they can't have him. These men are ready to turn our kingdom upside down. Surely, my king doesn't want to go to war against our closest allies. 
call the gods. You can't save me. You are the king. You are my uncle. <laughs> they are making a fool out of you. Take him away. Uncle, no. Secret. Tell us. We are the children of Fata. I'm a Jatume. The vengeance of the living. Meaning? Aga is alive. This is a party. Not a funeral. They made a fool out of us, my king. I will make them suffer for this. Gods? like we will complete building Agokoli's great wall tomorrow. The wall is almost weak enough to break through. But we must be cautious. Tell the people to get ready. We leave tomorrow. The hour for our freedom is near. <sighs>
From, from Monday to Monday, I thank God for my life, eh? thank God for my life, eh? yeah, yeah, yeah. From Monday to Monday, you still feel the sound rich, thank God you are alive, eh? yeah, oh, yeah. Thank God you are alive, eh?